John, did you answer this problem correctly? Maybe I did, maybe I didn't. Let's find out. What is 5 times 8? Well, it is... Forty. Okay. Good. You put the zero down and you carry the four. Oh, okay. Now. Sorry, that is a bad four. Now, what is five times four? Well, five times four is twenty. Plus the four is twenty-four. Good, you put the four down. Now you just have to carry the two. Now the two up there. Now what it is five times five? Twenty-five. Plus the two is twenty-seven. Twenty-seven. Oh, <laughs> uh, John! You forgot to put down your magic zero. No, I didn't. Okay, maybe I did. But. Let's first actually do this problem without the magic zero. We can't do that. Now we have to go and fix it. Okay. So, so 5 times 8 is 40. So we put the zero here and put the 4 up here. 4 times 5 is 20 plus the uh, 2 is or er, plus the 4 is 24 so we put the 2 up here then we put the 4 down here 5 times 5 is 25 plus the 7 is 27 or er, plus the 2 which is 27 6 and, okay then we'll finish with this. Then we do eight times three, four times three, and then five times three. And eight times three is is twenty four. And the magic zero has to go here. So we put the four next there. And then we carry. Oh, yeah, right then we do three times four, which is twelve, plus the two. That is four. So we put the four here. Then we do three times five, which is is fifteen plus the. Lost the one.